eu achei que eu fui muito bem, é, fiz o que minha equipe me passou, todas as estratégias e dei o meu máximo lá e deu certo. You know, I gave my all and we were lucky enough to be able to implement all of our training plans and our, everything that we wanted to do, we were able to do it on this fight, so we're pretty happy about it. É, na verdade, eu já imaginava que seria assim uma dura, uma luta muito dura, né? Que ela aguenta muita porrada. Já vi várias lutas dela e, é, na verdade, eu não, eu esperava, já esperava isso só, só que assim não esperava que ela fosse aguentar tanto. Mas é, vai do coração da pessoa, né? É, hoje ela mostrou que realmente ela tem um coração e que é muito guerreira. She has a lot of heart. She's such a true warrior, you know, and she was truly impressed with what Rosie put up there. Um, this is the first time that Jessica won a fight by decision. And she was surprised that at many points of the fight, the judge, the, the referee didn't stop it. But you know, props to Rosie. She really took a beating and you know, took it properly. É, na verdade, era alguns comentaristas e gente, lutadores também. E porque eu tenho pouco tempo de treino, é, são três anos de treino para estar aqui no UFC, então muita gente duvidou por causa da minha estreia e agora eu consegui mostrar que foi só um nervosismo de, de estreante mesmo e que eu vim para ficar e que se me derem a oportunidade eu tenho muita coisa para mostrar ainda e muita coisa para aprender. No, em Brasil, the, uh, after the first fight, reporters, commentators, fans, fighters, there was hate coming from everywhere. People were hating on the camp for having her fighting in the UFC, uh, you know, she only has three years of training. And so that is kind of understandable that so many people think, okay, it's too early thinking about the performance that she put on. But, you know, everybody in the camp is very much aware of how strong she is and that she is ready to, to fight pretty much anybody that they put in front of her. And the first fight was mainly a case of uh, first time jitters. But, you know, that's the main thing, like, It was our first chance to actually prove them wrong. Eu acho que sim, porque o, o seu treinador, o seu corner, ele te entende muito mais do que o juiz que está ali. Ele convive com você, ele sabe o seu limite, ele sabe a sua capacidade. Eu acho que devia sim ter esse direito e pra, tanto para é, né, cuidar da integridade física do atleta, né? Então acho que isso é muito importante. É, mas é, regras são regras, né? E se o juiz achou que não era o momento, fazer o quê, né? Infelizmente, a gente tem que trabalhar. You know, uh, she thinks that nobody knows the, the fighters' limits better than their coaches and their corners. You know, there's no way that a, a judge would know better about where a fighter is and how well he's dealing with the punishment than the people there with them every single day. So it could be an improvement if they were allowed to stop a fight. On some occasions for sure there could be issues and would be a problem but overall, you know, we're talking about fighter safety here. So it would be on the UFC's better interest probably to to allow the the corner to to stop a fight. Olha, eu acho que a Honda deve ganhar pelo pelo jogo dela, né, que é do chão. Mas, assim, a minha chatente também é muito boa em pé, então eu acho que vai ser uma luta bem disputada. Vai realmente ganhar quem tiver mais vontade e mais coração ali, mas que vai ser uma luta muito boa, vai, com certeza. Uh, for sure, it's going to be a war. And, uh, she thinks that Ronda is probably going to win uh, because of how their games match, but then again, Misha has better striking, uh, she has better wrestling. So, in the end, for sure, it's going to be an awesome fight. Uh, but she thinks that Ronda probably would win again.